Today we're at 223 Clydesdale Lane in Mableton, Georgia doing a move-in inspection. Very steep driveway. As you can see, it just goes straight down. Decent size yard at the house. As you can see, this is the back of the house. Nice back porch to sit on. Outside on the back. little creek that runs behind the house here. Go inside here. Front door is a little hard to open and close, but uh, it does work. When you enter, you enter straight into the living room. You can see, I'll give you a view of where we entered from. We entered from right here. You can see how the window's up top. You have a little space up there you can put some things, some plants, artwork, whatever you want to put. <clears throat> Got the brick fireplace. From the living room, when you walk towards the kitchen here, to the left you see stairs going up which lead to the bedrooms and a bathroom upstairs. And this door right here, which is actually in the kitchen, which is stairs leading down to what I labeled another bedroom because there's a closet down there, as well as the laundry room and the garage. Stay in the kitchen for now. You can see some upgraded appliances. See right here where we just came from. Nice countertops. It's a garage door opener right there. Got your sink and your dishwasher. Already tried the dishwasher, ran all the water in the house, everything seems to be working correctly. Just the stove again. Right here's the fridge. This door right here leads to the back deck. Back door does work. I've tried it already. It's a little dirty, 
but there's a back deck. Go ahead and go downstairs. We'll just knock that out real fast. So the stairs going down, the handrail, wall. Got right above you the smoke detector and the CO2 sensor. Gonna walk down the stairs now. Takes you directly into what I labeled bedroom number three. There's technically four bedrooms. One is just labeled the master. One window here. Got the closet right here with no door. You can see there was an area for a door. There just is not one anymore. Guess they decided they didn't want one. Right here you got the laundry room with the two sliding doors. They do open and close correctly. I did try them out and I have, have uh, taken a picture of that. Notice the floor down here. See the walls a little, little messed up. Also, I mean, just your normal wear and tear in the laundry room. You can see some marks on the wall, right here as well as right here. Got your shelf right there. Another shelf right here. Below this shelf is where the dryer is supposed to go, and below the right shelf is where the washer is supposed to go. Also, this door, which is. On the other side of this room here leads to the garage. Garage door does work. I opened and closed it already, as well as the garage door opener does work. I have tried both of those. We will go upstairs again. These are the stairs. It's going to take us right back up to the kitchen. And from the kitchen, we'll go directly into the living room. And from the living room, we will go up these stairs, which lead to the hallway here. Above us, you see the cross or the attic right there. At the light to the left here, you see the CO2 sensor and the smoke detector right when you walk up the stairs. Directly in front of you is the bathroom. That door right there, as well as this door, two bedrooms, and the only door on the right is the master. Let's go ahead and go to this first door on the left. It's the one I labeled bedroom number one. This right here is where we entered from. This right here is the closet. Right, we will exit this room. Go into the room next door, which is bedroom number two. Again, this right there is where we entered from. This door right here is the closet. There is one concern in this room behind the door in this very corner. You can see how the carpet's torn. It looks like it's starting to come up a little bit. So I did notice that. We'll walk back into the hallway here. Shows you where we came from down there. Um, we'll go to this hallway bathroom. There are only two bathrooms in the house. This is one of them. The other is located in the master. To the right behind the door, you got the bath and shower combination. In the left corner here, you got the sink. Toilet. Again, you got the bath shower combination.
If you notice, right here, it looks like there's a, I don't know what that is, something stuck to the bathtub, but I did, didn't make note of that earlier, so I'm going to make note of that now. Okay, we're going to walk out of the bathroom. And we're going to go to the master here, which is again the only door on the right when you walk up the stairs into the hallway. If you notice, I didn't notice this earlier, there's a little spot, maybe a little, looks like a little red stain in the carpet right there. Got the windows. This little area right here is where we entered from. You have two closets. This one right here, which I guess is considered the main closet. And you got a really small closet I'll show you in a minute. Also made note of this. Looks like the holes were re-drilled in this shelf. Uh, behind the entry door is the second door to the smaller closet, like I stated. This floor right here goes straight up because of the stairs below it. There's a shelf on the right. Can't walk in it again because it slips straight up. And on the left here, you can see there's some marks on the wall. All right, and last but not least, this door right here is the master bathroom. You can see right when you walk in to the right is the sink and a mirror, some light bulbs, there's the floor, kind of sort of right in front of you is the toilet, and to the left here behind the door is the bath and shower combination, I think you can look at, see a lot of mirrors here, again bath shower combination, Shower head, ceiling, towel rack, floor. Notice in the bathtub, it's a little dirty right here in this corner, but also the, the bathtub itself has some marks on it. I don't know if those are going to come up with some cleaning supplies, but I didn't make note of that. Again, this is the sink. That concludes our move-in inspection.